If you're tired of fiddling around with website blockers and firewalls on your PC just to block a simple website across 500 different avenues that it can be accessed, you're in the right place. My name is Yadullah, you're watching Candidor Technology and in this video we are talking about how you can block websites using the hosts file on Windows 11. Now, if you want to block websites uh, on your PC across browsers without having to fumble around with different uh, softwares and different browsers, there's a very simple and easy way to do it. We are going to modify the hosts file. So you'll find the hosts file in Windows C. Then we're going to go to uh, so the partition where you've installed Windows. Then we go to the Windows folder in there. So C drive, then Windows. Then we are going to find system 32 in here. And now I have to look for a folder called drivers. So just keep scrolling through this endless list until you start seeing folders. Yeah, right here. Uh, and as you can see here, we have the drivers folder. In here, we're going to go to etc. And here is our hosts file. Now this is the file that we're going to edit. So we're going to right click and uh, go to open with, and I'm going to select notepad from the list, click on just once. And as you can see, here is the hosts file open in notepad. Now you will see that there are a bunch of IP addresses already added in this, and this is exactly how we're going to block websites. So for example, if I come here and open, let's say you, not that, youtube.com, YouTube works just fine. Okay, great. So now in here, I'm just going to type in my local host address, which is, let me just expand this window for you guys a minute. So yeah, so I'm going to type in 127.0.0.1 followed by uh, whatever uh, the is the address of the website that you're looking to block so www.youtube.com and just as a preventive measure you should also block any alternative uh, names that might lead to the websites which in this case is just going to be youtube.com so now that you've covered both fronts save changes to the file and uh, this is a problem you'll run into at times if you don't launch notepad with admin privileges uh, you'll not be able to override this file so to do that we're going to close it bring up the start menu and search for notepad click on this arrow right here and then click on run as administrator this will ask you for uip permissions now head over to file and then open and now we're going to navigate to the same directory again. So uh, this is going to be Windows, Windows, System32. Next is uh, Drivers, then ETC. And then just select all files here. Then click on Hosts and click Open. So now we're in the file again. Let me just quickly add those changes. So 1.0.0.1 and then the address so www.youtube.com and then 127.0.0.1 youtube.com. I'm going to save the hosts file, close it. And now if I head back over to my browser, reload YouTube, it cannot run. So it says connect to the internet, but I am connected to the internet. As you can see right here, uh, this will even work if I don't do this. So let's say I just open youtube.com, redirects to the same thing and gives us the same error. And this is how easily you can block websites on a Windows 11 PC. 
if the hosts file doesn't work make sure that you restart your pc once again because that can uh, sometimes kick the host file into action but other than that this is how easy it is to block websites if you like these videos consider subscribing give us a thumbs up press the bell icon and tell us in the comments below if we can make any other such videos for you if you'd like to know more about tech visit our website candid or technology follow us on social media follow me on instagram or twitter and we'll see you in the next video